good afternoon YouTube as I said in my last video it's warming up here in the southwest and that means it's time to begin thinking about doing some fishing unfortunately my bass boat is a disaster it's been left out all winter I haven't paid any attention to it I haven't started it uh, so it's time to restore the thing and it's gonna be several videos long I hope you join with us uh, participate I've got some questions that I'm gonna need some help with so hopefully you guys can chime in and give me some advice and um, Hopefully at the end of the video series, I'll be taking it down to South Texas. We'll be fishing Lake Falcon. So hope you join us for this series. Enjoy it and stay tuned. Well, as you can tell, it is a disaster. And so I'm going to begin by cleaning the stupid thing out, taking these, taking these panels off. I'm going to replace all the, all the top panels. They crack. They're old plastic. They're brittle. So I'll take those off. I'll replace them. We'll be recarpeting it. And all of this will be hopefully brand new within just a couple of weeks. So we'll begin probably by cleaning it out and then we'll tackle, tackle a couple of things in the motor. Uh, we've got to do, we've got to replace the, got to replace the choke mechanism as well as rebuild the carburetors. And so I think what we'll begin with is just getting in here. We'll rip all this stuff out and we'll get it cleaned up. So we got everything taken off, all the panels, 
and we'll be cleaning it out. I'm going to let it dry. I tilted it. There's a little water in there. Uh, it's supposed to be dry here in Albuquerque for the next week or so, so it'll be plenty, plenty warm uh, and dry for it to completely get all the moisture out. So two questions that I have that maybe you guys can help me with. Number one, when I replace these, the plastic is too brittle, and so I can't use the original plastic. So I'm going to have to make um, something to replace those with. Is there any problems with using three-quarter inch plywood? I'm a little worried about the weight and I'll be carpeting all of this in and it'll have carpet over it and we'll put an extra panel right here and so it'll be flush all the way to the front and it'll be carpeted over. I'm just curious if, if it's too much weight for the boat. I don't think it is but I want your opinion. Also, my gel coat is just about gone. Uh, well, it is gone and so I probably won't be able to bring this red back at all but is there anything I can do to bring it to make it shine just a little bit more so I'm thinking wax and so if it's got a little bit of moisture it'll it'll pop out a little bit so I'm thinking wax um, and a little bit of buffing so if you guys could help me with those two issues I would greatly appreciate it and next thing I'm going to tackle is the engine I got to replace the choke mechanism and also redo the carburetors so thanks for enjoying part one and please if you have any information or tips for me uh, let me know in the comment section below. Be sure to subscribe. There will be several videos uh, from start to completion on this little uh, 83 Skeeter bass boat. Thank you guys so much.